Hey friends, uh, I had a couple of people ask me for an update on this $5,000 house. Uh, Josh Rendy and Alex Madinger, and I figured maybe a couple others might want to see too. Uh, plus, I want to show it off. So here it is. Ta-da! We've got siding. Uh, so I learned something about siding. I went with the hardy cement board siding because I thought this is going to look nicer. I think it'll increase the property value a little bit. Uh, and I was shocked that it wasn't white like I had asked for. Uh, so I learned you have to paint this stuff. Um, so it's going to be white. Uh, the windows are black as you can see. And this door is going to be painted black as well. Um, we're actually going to go with a model that's um, got one row less windows. I thought that would be better for a front door, a little bit more private. Um, so that's coming. There have also been a few issues. So like every project there's uh, you know, bumps in the road. So I wanted to kind of share with you, not to be negative, uh, but just to kind of be more transparent, you know, about some of the struggles that I've had and how I've attempted to deal with them. So um, that might be helpful for you. So the first thing is, I don't know if you can notice the front porch roof line, if you look closely, it's slanted. So it's like very so subtle, but I think I might have OCD because I just couldn't stand it. I was like, you guys, we gotta fix this. Um, so guess which way it's slanted. I'm gonna tell you in a second. Uh, this way. Yeah, so I'm gonna, it's like too low on this side. So I don't know how they're gonna fix that, but I've asked a few times. I'm excited to see it uh, fixed. The other issue we had was actually kind of humorous. Uh, this window right here, it's a little bit wider than the one that was there before. And whenever the installer came, he actually bumped it up. It was off center because that's where the existing stud was. And that was obviously like the easy choice for him. Um, but I really thought it was important for it to be centered with this, this peak of the house because it's, it's the front of the house and I want it to look, you know, nice. And so um, I, I explained it a little bit to him, but he, he didn't speak English. So I had to um, ask my general contractor to relay the message. And then when I came back, uh, it was actually uh, too far the other way, uh, which was really funny and also a little bit frustrating. On the third time, he got it right though, so I'm really pleased with it now. Um, somebody made a comment about this rubble, uh, which is also kind of funny because it's just been sitting here for weeks. Uh, but this uh, used to be like a, like a stone cement paved um, porch. And if you look closely, there's like red painted concrete um, on that part of the house. It's actually a little bit, um, quite a, a large step up from the existing, um, you know, wooden deck that's built there now. Um, but the reason why um, we got rid of it was because, and, and my general contractor was great, he didn't charge me extra for the labor to get rid of it, even though it wasn't in our original bid, so thank you. Um, but we, we extended the roof line, you know, to have this like nice front porch. And it, it is nice, it's got recessed lights under there and everything, so you're gonna be able to sit here, drink lemonade um, on a nice um, Indiana summer night. It's like 9 p.m. right now, it stays light forever here. But. Uh, yeah, anyway, so we built that wood deck so it would um, have enough headroom when you walk up without hitting your head on this porch. I'm 6'2", so that was a necessity. Um, and so I think we're gonna have to, uh, that's why the rubble's there, and we're gonna have to build a little step up as well. So I'm gonna walk around this house like just real fast. I'm gonna try to keep the angle good. Oh, there's my neighbor. All right, so, yep, here's my house. It's gonna be bedroom window. This is, uh, the old door is here, but it's now, you know, sided, because there's another bedroom right here. This is a master. And then this is the uh, the bathroom that we uh, we built. It's really nice inside. And then uh, back here, I was like, whoa, what do we got going on here with this gray siding? But I suppose they're gonna paint it, right? And it's gonna look the same, I hope so. And then, oh, my neighbor's dog. And then we're gonna have uh, like a railing around this uh, back patio right here. And then this this door is actually um, the one that's gonna be in the front because it's got the smaller windows and it's gonna be more private. And then we're gonna put that one with nine windows that's in the front now in the back. Um, so that way, you notice there's like no, no real big windows in the back of the house, um, but that will give us some more natural light in the kitchen, which I personally feel is really important. I always feel better when I can see sunshine. So that is the update on the house. Um, uh, stay tuned for a second. I'm gonna give you a sneak peek of what's going on inside.
I was like, holy cow, we've got a lot of stuff going on in here. And uh, this is a lot of insulation. There is HVAC going in. You can see like uh, the vents going into the attic right now. And then if you see those wires, that's my electrical job I was really proud of. And right now I'm gonna finish up the electrical job by running the big wire um, from the, the meter box, oh, excuse me, from the breaker box, which is in the master uh, bedroom back here. I know it's dark. And connect that to the meter box outside of the house where the service from the power line will come in. So, um, no, I'm not an electrician, but this is my house. I can do the electrical work. Um, I just have a, a background in electrical engineering, so I thought it would be a fun project. Turned out to be a little more time consuming than I thought, but uh, it has been fun, and it's like always gonna be something I remember as my first renovation project um, that I got to do a little work on it myself. So I'm really pumped about that. It'll be in, inspected um, and make sure it's all good before we hook it up, so don't worry. I know you're worried about it. And uh, yeah, stay tuned. Oh, I wanna show you these. I put these recessed lights in here on this porch. I told you it was nice. All right, see you guys.